we have grandmaster r prakananda he just defeated uh, arjun erigaisi in an exhilarating match to advance to the semi finals of fide world cup congratulations prag yeah thank you well you have also earned a spot in the candidates 2024 uh, well according to what uh, magnus uh, said so how does it feel yeah it's not confirmed that <laughs> i would like to you know confirm that um, yeah but uh, yeah i mean it feels great i mean apart from the spot i think um it was just about nerves at the end and i am happy that i managed to kind of uh, mm, like i wouldn't say calm totally i mean i was just trying to be calm and yeah somewhere in between and um uh, yeah i think the last game was good one so in that way i'm happy well uh, talking about the last game you arrived i think more than 30 seconds late in a sudden death so what happened actually Yeah, I just went to the restroom. I was trying to, you know, calm myself down. I was just washing my face, you know, relaxing. Um I mean, just washing my face basically. Um and then I I thought I had time, but then I didn't know like I didn't realize that uh, um that I might be even sh- like I might have to run. Even that I didn't realize, but when I came to the board, I was I lost 30 seconds, so yeah. Um but somehow I mean, the one thing I'm very happy there was I managed to you know get myself together and um, kind of not collapse and play logical moves so which was good. What would you say to be the turning point of the match because uh, it started with two draws then you and Arjun both traded wins and uh, in the sudden that uh, you prevailed. I don't know what is turning point honestly because um yeah I think by the I mean he just played brilliantly of course uh, to come back twice um and i think he was also in in those two games he was playing much better than uh um uh, than i did and yeah um but yeah i think the last game okay i don't know it's blitz game and um i think in mean, a blitz game is just about not uh, getting too much tensed and also this is very high stake one so i was just trying to be calm i think that's kind of thing uh yeah there was required thing at that point in the third tie break game which was the first uh, 10 plus 10 when uh, arjun played queen c4 in the queen and rook end game and things started going your way you traded the queens uh, would you say like uh, that is when uh, the momentum shifted towards you yeah that queen c4 yeah for sure i mean i was just i mean i don't know if i should say lost maybe lost according to the computer but still there were lot of tricks i mean as we saw in the game uh, with with little time anything can happen and yeah i was uh, happy to see queen c4 and i found this um that yeah my pawn is just faster and he can't protect uh, a6 and yeah even then i thought it should be a draw but then somehow it, things got very tricky I, i don't know there should be a defense for him but um we both had less than a minute and um, and yeah it was tough uh, tough to find a defense Prag you also became the first Indian to advance to the semi final of a FIDE World Cup. So what does it mean to you? Wait, well, Anand sir. Well, that was a different format. So uh, the current format uh-huh. we considered it from 2005 which was won uh, so what would you say? Ah okay. Yeah, I mean um yeah, I'm happy. <laughs> I think uh yeah, I think the win still hasn't sunk in so uh, just calm down and relax for now well during your tie break matches we saw your mother nagalakshmi in attendance at the audience so would you say that uh, having your mom in the audience uh, gave you some extra energy or power yeah it's definitely good to have someone here and yeah my mother is always supportive and um yeah even after j- losing she was just trying to calm me down and I was yeah it's good to have someone uh, rooting for you here and for me yeah, my mother is you support not only for me for my sister also yeah she was quite worried when uh, the sudden death of blitz fans started and uh, you were like a nobody to be found everyone was looking for you uh, in the semi final you're going to face uh, fabiano caruana who is definitely one of the favorites so what are your thoughts on this match yeah it's going to be a tough match and yeah i'm looking forward to um play against him i mean he's just a very strong player um yeah for now i, uh, I have n- like no idea about that match i'll just yeah for now i think i really need to relax and uh kind of forget about this match 
Have you ever faced him in any over the board tournament? Yeah, I played him in twice in classical, I think. Tata Steel. Yes. Yeah, Tata Steel both years. Uh, yeah, but na, I don't think we have played so many, so much time, I, even in rapids. Well, those who were in attendance uh, said that this was the best match of this World Cup. Do you feel so? Yeah, maybe for uh, for yeah watching it might be, but yeah for playing it's definitely not. <laughs> Okay, thank you, Prag. We won't take any more longer of your time. You need to rest, and uh, yeah, tomorrow is a rest day, so you will get ample amount of time to regroup yourself. Once again, congratulations for advancing to the semi-final, and good luck for your match against Fabiano Caravano. Yeah, thank you.